Pirates in general have something magical about them. This is the reason why video game developers have created many pirate-themed video games over the years. These games often romanticize the harsh reality of this historical era and present a more glamorous version of piracy that appeals to many players. Being a pirate is one of the most freeing experiences you can have. From insult sword fights to treasure plundering and ruthless naval battles, you'll have no shortage of adventures as a swashbuckler. The variety of genres that pirate games cover is impressive to say the least. Classic point-and-click adventures, city builders, open world and isometric RPGs, they can all be found on this list of the 10 best pirate games coming out in 2022 and 2023. Starting off with number 10, we have Sugar Winds, a Caribbean city building game with sales, trade and an RTS touch. Enjoy the power and flexibility of a traditional city building game in a pirate themed environment. You'll have to make sure your people are fed and happy while you produce over 80 different products. The game offers a real-time strategy approach. Once the enemy is on land, you'll be able to choose units and organize an attack against the incoming invasion. Another useful tactic is to buy war items to defend your city against attacks in case you lack the necessary firepower. You'll have access to the world map and to about 20 cities that you can head for and trade with, but don't forget that sailors need food and water on long voyages. With your ship, you'll be able to buy and sell goods in any city in the Caribbean or in Europe. The game is currently in early access with a release date yet to be announced. Next up, at number 9, we have Salt 2, Shores of Gold, an open-world pirate game with a focus on exploration, survival and crafting. Set sail across an infinite ocean with just you and your ship. Explore islands filled with massive caves and ancient ruins, pirate camps and villages, and other mysterious locations. The world is procedurally generated, so you'll never run out of islands to explore. Hunt and fish for food, find resources to craft rare items, decorate your ship, go on epic quests, and fight pirates and other dangerous enemies. Salt 2 also features RPG aspects such as loot rarities, player levels and talents to let you customize your character to fit your playstyle. This isn't a game about naval combat, but rather about exploring the sea, going on quests, and discovering interesting places and loot. Therefore, the developers decided to generate the world procedurally to let you explore in any direction for as long as you want. The game is expected to be released in August 2022. At number 8, we have Rise of Piracy. Rise of Piracy is a single and multiplayer pirate game. It offers an exploration-style action-adventure mixed with RTS and progressive fleet building, the conquest of islands and large-scale expansion. It's heavily inspired by Cutthroats, Terror on the High Seas, The Black Sails TV Show, and other RTS and cooperative games. Choose from five types of dedicated infantry and fill your ships with a crew of your choice, specializing them for their usefulness in combat. Fully destructible environments and buildings allow you to level an island with deployable land cannons or bombard it from afar with your fleet. The game features over 30 playable ships, a sophisticated diplomacy and trade system with different ports that have special trade routes and dedicated merchants for over 200 different commodities. Rise of Piracy is currently in early access and is expected to be released in 2022. At number 7, we have Cursed Crew, a roguelike ship simulator where you control an 18th century sailing ship in a fantasy setting. You'll control a captain and be responsible for making sure that the crew survives all the dangers of the dark seas you're sailing. You'll have to make sure that there are enough resources such as wood, food and cannonballs on the ship, and when all hell breaks loose, you'll have to guide your, not always competent, crew through it. As the game progresses, your crew will become more and more cursed, which will give unique twists to your playthrough. If you make the right decisions, the curses can even be beneficial to your survival. Mutiny, starvation, death from cold or heat, or just going insane are all realistic scenarios that await this strange group of misfits. And if that wasn't enough, you'll also get the chance to meet various terrifying sea bosses, such as an ancient shark, kraken, or even dragon. The game is currently in early access, with a release date still to be announced. In sixth place, we have Corsair's Legacy, an open-world role-playing game. You have full freedom to develop your main character, and the choices you make will have an impact on the fate of other characters. The game is based on two different modes, a ground-based RPG mode in which you'll control the main character, and a mode in which you'll control a sailing boat. Immerse yourself in the historical pirate life simulator in the carefully recreated environment of the Caribbean at the end of the 17th century. 
A wide range of blades and weapons was created based on well-preserved historical samples, museum pieces, and their replicas. The real models also formed the basis for ships, forts, and cannons. The project also tries to get as close as possible to the economy of the time while keeping the game balanced. The upcoming demo on Steam should reveal more about the gameplay, and we hope to get a full version sometime later in 2022. Before we continue, if you liked this video, please consider hitting that like button, subscribe if you are new to the channel as it really helps the channel to grow, and enable all notifications by clicking the notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any of the videos coming up soon. At number 5, we have Fregato, Shadows of the Caribbean, a challenging real-time tactics stealth game set in the fascinating world of pirates. Utilize a diverse repertoire of character abilities to successfully defeat your foes. Be a quiet and elusive pirate hero or a bloodthirsty murderer who tortures his victims. But pay attention to your crew, since the path you choose will inspire respect in some, while it can drive others to mutiny. Take command over a motley crew of sea rogues and defeat the superior forces of the enemy. A good plan and tactical thinking are essential, but if all else fails, you can always fall back on your intuition and improvise. Embark on a journey through the Caribbean Sea in the golden age of piracy. At the moment, Fregato, Shadows of the Caribbean doesn't have a release date, but you'll be able to play a short demo on Steam, available in June 2022. Next, in fourth place, we have the Pirate Simulator. Start as a newbie on a boat as small as a canoe and use your clever pirate maneuvers to buy, craft, or arrange attachments for your dream ship. Replace necessary parts, attach equipment for trips, focus on speed or durability, and choose your own style to rule the seas. Visit towns and ports along your way, have a pint or five, and recruit a crew that will make you a true pirate because on the seas, you may encounter other ships that are simply carrying too many goods not to plunder. Whether you're trading, looting, or finding treasure, you'll need to collect and stack your goods somewhere. When you discover the perfect place on a beach or in a cave, claim it for yourself and take care of the infrastructure and buildings to make your business thrive. The release date for Pirate Simulator is yet to be announced. At number 3, we have returned to Monkey Island, the long-awaited follow-up to the legendary secret of Monkey Island and Monkey Island 2, LeChuck's Revenge, by Ron Gilbert's Terrible Toy Box in collaboration with Devolver Digital and Lucasfilm Games. The official secret of Monkey Island has yet to be revealed, but Gilbert has said in the past that he'd spill the beans if he got to work on the third installment. Whether we'll ever know, we'll have to wait and play the game to find out. We do not know much about this new game, except that it will be released sometime in 2022, and that we will start the game right at the end of Monkey Island 2. As a refresher, at the end of our journey, we discover that all the adventures we just had were nothing more than a product of a child's imagination playing in an amusement park. However, Mr. Gilbert left us with one crucial cliffhanger at the very end, which the new game is supposed to follow up on, so we'll have to wait and see where the story takes us now. Let us know down in the comments if you remember this detail. We are very excited about Return of Monkey Island and hopefully more information is coming up soon. In second place we have a survival sandbox, Pirate Commander. You manage the entire ship and take care of the crew and their physical and mental health, food, drinking water, medicine, weapons and ammunition. Ports are a great way to upgrade your galley and find better equipment for yourself and your ship. By expanding your galley you'll be able to improve your ship's performance and make it more comfortable for your shipmates. Our crew will have to prepare weapons, load cannons, fight fires and take care of supplies, maintain mental health through diet, sleep and entertainment, and of course, fight. In addition, the game has a manual cannon aiming system, thanks to which the battles are very satisfying and dynamic. Recruit crew members from defeated enemies or from sailors at the docks. Explore an open world full of marine mysteries and exotic islands. You can use the ship's section view to see how each room, galley element, and crew member behaves and issue orders accordingly. This is especially useful during battles when you'll have to be ready for anything. Although the release date is still unknown, Pirate Commander could easily prove to be one of the upcoming surprise hits. Coming in at number 1, we have Skull and Bones, one of the most highly anticipated pirate games in recent years. Skull and Bones is a tactical action-adventure video game set in a shared open-world environment and played from a third-person perspective. You are a pirate captain who has refused the king's pardon and sailed from the Caribbean to the Indian Ocean, an untamed frontier full of lavish riches. In order to survive, you will have to build a lethal fleet, prey upon lucrative trade routes, and ally with other pirates in your endless struggle for supremacy. 
Skull and Bones drew inspiration from the naval battles of Assassin's Creed IV Black Flag. Players take control of a customizable pirate captain and may choose to sail the Indian Ocean by themselves and set off on a single-player campaign, or gather up to five other players to ally in player versus player gameplay in disputed waters. Take advantage of detailed ship customization to suit your current goals by changing between broadside cannons, mortars and rockets. Use your weapons and spyglass to stalk and destroy your prey. Wind positioning can be assessed to gain an advantage in battle. Players may collect additional ships throughout the game, such as sloops of war, frigates and brigantines. Ships can be charged into with brute force and boarded. The rate of inflicted damage is gauged by the health bar. A core component is the multiplayer mode, Loot Hunt, where two groups of players are challenged in treasure hunting to further accumulate their riches. Skull and Bones was confirmed for Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, with enhancements for PlayStation 4 Pro and Xbox One X, and after a lot of delays over the past few years it should finally come later in 2022. And that's gonna be it for this video. So what are your thoughts on this? Which of these games are you most looking forward to? Did we miss out on any of your favorite upcoming games? Or do you maybe disagree with some of the items on the list? Let us know down in the comments below. Many thanks for watching, as we really hope you found this type of content helpful. So hit that like button if you did, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. This was the HQ Gaming News, and hopefully, we'll see you all very soon in the following video. Until then, have a ton of fun.